Season 3 is finally here in Rocket League, and that means brand new tournament rewards. In today's video, I've got nearly 60,000 credits over on my second account, which we're starting on now, and I've also got a decent amount on my main account. So in Season 2, I only got one Black Market, which unfortunately was a regular unpainted Nurgle, and yeah, that was very disappointing, but hopefully this season, in Season 3, brand new season, hopefully the look can improve. But if you do enjoy today's video, it would mean a lot if you could drop a like on it, and subscribe if you're new around here, because less than 5% of you watching are actually subscribed, so it does really help me out. But we're going to be opening just Prospect Rewards for the first couple of months of this season, and then if we're later down the line, and I don't have the Black Market, I'm gonna start moving on to all stars cups, but in this video We're just gonna open prospects cups try our luck and let's see what we get But without further ado, let's get into the brand new tournament rewards All right, so now we're on the tournament menu You can see in the top right I've got 56,000 credits and we can get a decent amount of prospects cups out of that And if we look at the rewards atomic blip is the old explosion and in my opinion This is slightly nicer than Hades bomb. It's not that much nicer, but it is really good The goal explosion is slightly better than the, the decal I think but the discoid actually competes like the nurgle was the worst black market in rocket league history honestly it was the discoid is actually really nice like, i'm not even gonna lie especially in my car setup right now this color combination the discoid is really nice like last season i was annoyed when i got the black market decal the nurgle this season i'd be very happy even if we got one of the two black markets because they both look really good moving on to the exotics then the we have these wheels which at first i really didn't like them but i mean you can see the glow they are really nice actually like, i don't mind them if you got these in a decent paint like a look, if you got this in titanium white or crimson i'm sure they look really nice and the gold explosion okay a lot of people have liked this. For me, I don't really like it. I'm sure if it was painted, it'd be really nice. But this isn't for me, this gold explosion, the chromatic hollow. Getting onto the imports then, we have the uninverted chain helm wheels. And they're okay. Obviously, the exotics are better. But these, in my opinion... At first, I thought these were the nicest wheels, but I'm kind of preferring these ones on the exotics, but these are really nice as well, these wheels. I'm sure in, like, Cobalt or something like that, or Saffron, these would actually look really nice. Obviously, in white and black as well, they look really good. Now, these wheels, I they're, they're one of the worst wheels I've ever seen. A lot of people would like them, but to be fair, though, these rewards, I swear we have a, we're meant to have a racing car-themed Rocket Pass, and I thought the tournament rewards would go hand-in-hand hand with that, but we've literally not got anything here to do with... F1 or NASCAR. Yeah, these wheels, as long as we avoid these wheels, happy days, honestly. I'll take any other import, even this boost. I mean, I, this boost is really nice. I mean, a lot of people are going to be using this boost because a lot of people use the tournament rewards boost. And I'm just glad this one doesn't make you lag like a terror kinesis does. So anything's an improvement from that. But this actually looks really nice. I'm not even going to lie. I'm not going to use it just because I don't like having big boosts. Because imagine playing like that, it's going to be a bit annoying, isn't it? But imagine if you get this in a decent color. Like, if you get this in white or crimson, it'd look really good. And then moving on to very rares here, we get the trails and... We have these wheels, which are all right. They're not amazing. They're nothing amazing, are they? But they're okay. And then these wheels, yeah, they're, they're not amazing as well. They just remind me of the London Eye. It's like a very wheel, a little bit in the middle. And they have the school tread. But yeah, I'm not going to go into the rares of the uncommons because obviously we're going to be seeing loads of them. And let's just get started. First Prospects Cup of the season. What can we get? I'm guessing an uncommon, but let's just do it. Okay, we're starting with a Merc decal. Very fitting. Like, I'm never going to use the Merc. And we're back to back Merc decals. Octane edgewise. Alright, this decal actually looks pretty decent. I mean, I don't use the Octane, but it looks decent. Here's the Dominus decal. Actually, wait, thinking about it, I'm going to make a new preset. I mean, my preset isn't very, like, different to normal anyway. It's pretty plain, but let's just carry on going now. I'm not going to open... Okay, we're getting player anthems. I'm not going to open all stars this video, I don't think. I'm going to stick to these. Sky blue. I'm pretty sure that looks like the normal one. I mean, we'll equip that because it looks alright. Crockwood's player banner. Decent. I mean, the Crockwood would be decent painted. Crimson. Wait... How? It's... Okay, I see. The top changes a little bit. I'm obviously going to block up my avatar as well, just because this is my second account. But moving on. Dominus, we get that banner before. And what are we going to get now? The moon. Okay, the striker. We're getting a striker moon. Love it. I, I don't understand why that's in there. It's pretty... It's like a joke item. But okay, I'm going to equip this because this decal looks really nice. Like, look at this. Obviously, with nice colours. That's why I kind of wish I used the octane, because they just get better decals. We've got about 40k left. We're getting an orange croc wood. Okay, um... Bit of a strange one, but, you know, it's going to get traded up anyway. We're getting a radioactive banner, a Merc decal again. Can we get, like, a very rare or better in the prospects? A pink radioactive, you know, that actually looks decent. I might have to equip that. The forest green real winner that I've got equipped in the moment is going to have to go. Getting a Merc decal here. Uh, another octane decal. I'm just going slow just because, you know, okay, that actually looks not bad. A crimson crockwood. I mean, it's a joke item. It'll probably get traded up, like I said before. But if I'm going to keep a rare, I'll keep that one because that doesn't even look that bad. Moving on, Octane decal, the Octane decal again. Okay, breaking it with a Merc decal and the grey crockwood. I thought it was black. I'm getting excited over painted banners. A burnt sienna radioactive. You know what? We haven't had a burnt sienna item yet. It's only fitting we get one this video, isn't it? Uh, okay, the first very rare we get 
is a player ramp from which for me feels a bit of a scam i know people have been talking about this obviously i'm not in grand champ or better i'm only i've been putting champ tournaments recently and i did pretty well in them yesterday but obviously i can't get the the last cup which is the i think it's called the champions cup and that's a guaranteed paint it says but if you get the very air player ramp from it doesn't come painted so it's a bit of a scam nowadays it's a bit of false advertisement but i don't understand why there's player anthems in this i don't really agree with that but you know they can do what they want but because there's good black markets in here and hopefully we can get one uh, but not at this rate, because we're getting Dominus decals, and yeah, it's not brilliant. We, I swear it's a lot of four form we've had in a row. Right, okay, we got the moon. Okay, anything. If it's the moon, it can live. Like, it's probably going to get traded up anyway. An Octane decal striker, yeah. Dominus decal. We're just getting these decals. Okay, the first input we get, okay, you know what? I'll take that, because we can trade these up. These will stack up. I feel like the looks are a little bit worse than the prospects than they were before. I don't know why. Like, by this point, we would have had multiple imports, and we've only had one. So... Uh, it's been a bit of a letdown so far, but we've got a couple more left. We've got two more left, I think. And last one on this account. Can we get anything good? Of course we can't. Okay, the Merc decal. Let me check if we can do any trade-ups, because I know the trade-up screen's really laggy at the moment, but I'm just going to get through these trade-ups. That's all the ones we could do. Okay, we've got three chances that are very rare. Um, something good. We've got a cow napper there. I'm going to try and keep that. I might have to trade that off, but I doubt we'll get this accolade series too. Anyway. Okay, Grey Shark attack. Uh... I don't know about that. I don't really like that trial, to be honest. Yeah, let's do that. I'm not going to use Avatar Border anyway. Okay, the Saffron Yoked 1Ks. You know what? They're okay. I mean, they're better than the Burners, I think. The very rare ones are better than the Burners. The inverted ones are definitely not. Let's get rid of these five uh, anthems here. Can we get a painted? Okay, Striker Shark Attack. Not great. All right, we've got two chances at an import. Oh, wait, we can get an exotic today. Because if we get two imports, we can get an exotic. All right, good. Okay, we can get an exotic. Let's just do this. Hopefully, we get Accolade 2 just because. Okay, Chain Elm, alright. We've got an Accolade 2 trade up here. I'm going to keep the purple Intercross. It doesn't look that bad. And what can we even get from Accolade Series 2? I've completely forgotten. It's only been like a week since it's gone, but what can we get? Terra Kinesis, alright. That's getting traded up without a doubt. Okay, we've got a chance in exotic. This could be from. It's got a 40% chance of being from. No, it's got a 60% chance, sorry, of being from Accolade Series 2. And it's got a 40% chance of read from Accolade Series 3. So hopefully we can get a painted hand heart. Because obviously after this point, there's zero chance of me getting a painted hand heart ever again. Or just painted Zokos. Uh, the painted Zoko inverted. Please give me something good. I'm begging. Like, a nice, decent coloured hand heart, please. It's a hand heart. It's a normal hand heart. Alright. Feels like a bit of a scam to be fair. But unfortunately that's all we got on the second account. But let's switch over to the main account now. And hopefully we can get a bit better on there. Guys, okay, so we're on the main account now. Let me check how much tournament credits we've got. We have 20,000, alright? It's not a great amount, but it's still better than nothing. Let me uh, make a new preset, just in case we do get something good. Um, that's trading. Create a new preset, okay. We might be able to get a black market if we can get some decent imports on Exotic, because then I'll be able to do trade-ups. Let's just get started. We haven't got very many on here, but first one, pink Dominus decal, probably getting traded up. Octane decal. You know, I might go for an All-Stars Cup. I said I wouldn't, but... I might just go for it because the prospects have been awful today. If we do one more. Yeah, okay. Let's just go for an all-stars. I'll probably get a very rare, but hopefully we can get like an exotic one import. Or even a black market would be really good. But let's just see. Exotic. Chromatic hollow and forest green. Okay, you know what? Chromatic hollow and forest green. Let's see what this looks like because I reckon that would look really sick. I mean, I don't really like this gold explosion, but in paints, I reckon it'd look decent. Let's see what this looks like. Oh, oh my god. Okay, <laughs> to be fair, that is really slick. I'm not even going to lie. Let's see this again. That is really nice. I'm going to be using that for a little bit, I think, because that's really good. Let's see if we can do the trade-ups. Uh, we can get an exotic. I think we can get two exotics, actually. Yeah, we can get two exotics. So let me try these up. Okay, please give us some... We've got 60% chance of getting Accolade Season 2 and 40% for Accolade Series 3. So let's just see what we're going to get. Please be Accolade Series 2. That would be hope. would be good. Okay, Rolly Burst Burns, you know what? I'll take that. Import now. We can trade this. I'm already keep the white intercross. That's why I did all that. The purple one's gonna have to go. I'm afraid, but we got the white one, so it's all good. Let's just do that, please. Something, hopefully not something good because I don't want to trade it up. Okay, that's fine. Let's go to an exotic now. So we're getting an accolade series two exotic. So this can either be a Zoku inverted or a hand heart. Please, something good. We didn't get anything on the last account. Can we get a titanium white hand heart or titanium white Zoku inverted? That'd be the main goal. Please, something good. It's just painted at least. Getting a hand heart. A normal hand heart again. I don't know what's going on. My luck is just awful for hand hearts. But unfortunately, we want to like off of getting the black market. But we'll be able to get that next episode. Alright, so 100% the best thing we got in today's video 
Force the Forest Green Chromatic Hollow, and hopefully in the next episode we can get ourselves a Black Market, hopefully from Accolade Series 2, just because after this point I won't be able to get any Black Markets, and we have a chance at Hades Bomb then, but... Hopefully next episode we can do that. But I'm going to try my hardest to get these out every week. It's going to be a lot of tournament grinding, a lot of hard work. But I really want to get something good out of this series. Because last season I didn't get anything good really. I got an unpainted Nurgle which I'm never going to use let's be honest. So hopefully we can get something good from this series. But that's been it for me today. I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. If you did remember to leave a like on the video and subscribe if you're new around here. It really helps me out. And let me know your guys thoughts on that forest screen chromatic hollow actually. Because it, I didn't like the unpainted chromatic hollow. But... The forest green one, I'm not going to lie, is actually really good. I don't know why my frames have got a, my game. Like, since I did them trade-ups at the end, my game's just really laggy for some reason. But that's been it for me. I hope you did enjoy, and I'll see you in the next video.